welcome back to the channel. So in this video, let's see how we can manage product categories in order 14 point of sale. So for that, just open point of sale module. So you can see all the uh, point of sales that is chops and bars in uh, the module. And if you want to configure that is create new point of sale that is chops or bars, you can click on create button to create that. Okay, now let's see how we can configure category. So for that under products, you have an option that is menu point of sale product category. So just open that and you can see all the pre-configured categories in Odo that is chairs, desk, drinks, food and miscellaneous category. And if you want to create a new category, just click on create button. And here you have to provide the name of the category. So I'm creating a category soft drinks. Then if this is a sub of a category, you can provide the parent category and provide a sequence number that is to decide the sequence order. That is this case of sequence order when displaying a list of product categories. So I'm saving this. So as I have given one as a sequence number, you can see it is displayed at the top of list that is soft drinks. So after setting this category, that is creating category, let's go to products. And okay, you can see all the products available in a retail shop, that is point of sale. So just open a product. So for this product, uh, Coca-Cola, you can see on the point of sale tab uh, that this product is made, already made available in point of sale, but no category is set for this product. So I'm setting the category or group as soft drinks for this product. Okay. Now come back to dashboard. And when you go to settings of uh, point of sale here under point of sale interface section, you can see option to set category pictures. That is, if you want to display category pictures, then you can enable this option. And here you can see, uh, so this can be used for directly going to product category configuration. So just open soft drinks. And when you edit this, you have an option to add image for the category. So after setting, save it and now come back to dashboard. And when you start a new session, select the cashier. So here you can see uh, the different categories available in point of sale, like soft drinks, chairs, desk, drinks, food, miscellaneous. And you can see the category picture that you have set for the a recently created category that is soft drinks. Now let's check how we can restrict some categories in order 14 uh, point of sale. So for that close uh, session. Close and post entries because we are going to make change in settings. So when you go to settings. Here. You can see that option that is to restrict product categories. So when you enable this, you can pick which product categories uh, need to be available in your retail shop. So if I only want soft drinks, drinks and food, you can add that categories. Now save it. Now when you start session, a new session. So you can see only these three categories are available in the retail shop. Okay, so you can see our soft drinks. Uh, the product Coca-Cola is available under this category. So now customer can choose a the product, then make the payment. And it's also possible to set a start category, default start category for your retail shop, that is a point of sale. So for that, go to settings. So here you can set a start category. So it's already enabled and here I'm going to set food, okay, drinks as a start category. Now save the settings and start a new session.
okay so you can see drinks is set as the start category for the retail shop okay so that's all about managing product categories in order 14 point of sale and if you have any doubts regarding this video please add your comments below and if you're looking for any uh, implementation or customization related to this uh, point of sale drop your request to order at cybrosis.com